retiring? Your mom told you. Yeah, of course she told me. This is big news. I was hoping she wouldn't tell you. I was hoping that maybe someday, years from now, you'd come back and say, didn't we have a pastor, Dale? But, but what, about, what about us? You baptized me. You, you confirmed me. You've been there, here, this, the whole time. Like, now you won't be able to do my wedding. Well, if we could arrange to have your wedding this summer, I could still do it. Well, we'll talk about that later. You know, Quinn, I wasn't ready for you to go to college. Those changes are hard, you know, but I knew it was right for you. I knew it was the right time for you. And look at you. You're getting ready for graduate school now. You're going to be commissioned. And I'm just so excited for you, what the transitions have meant. Well, what are, what are we supposed to do? I don't, I don't want you to leave. There's, I don't think anybody wants you to leave. Yeah. You know, there's that part where I just, it's hard to imagine not being here. And that's why I like the idea of being able to come back in a part-time role to make some coffee and guard the donut table, teach some Bible studies and, and greet people. Um, it's time. We have such great staff here and to bring in somebody who sees with new eyes and, you know, just continues to grow along with you and others here. Uh, I'm just excited for the future of Mount Calvary.